right, welcome back everybody to quarterfinals day. And every match so far today has felt like a final. it has been absolutely epic. Uh, we just had Vondi taking out Sabalenka, big upset there. And uh, now we've got the match of the day. This is the most hyped match because the two players, two most popular players in the draw are playing. Raducanu versus Sviantek. They played here two years ago. Uh, and it was a straight sets win. Raducanu saying all the right things, saying, oh, it's two years later, I'm more mature, I play, I'm better than I was. She's saying all the right things, but can she get a result? A lot of people think she might be able to get a set here. We'll find out. Let's go see how they got here, though. Igor Sviantek versus Emma Raducanu. There's a third quarter final for the Stuttgart Open for 2024. And if it's anything like two years ago, this one should be a banger. Raducanu entered the tournament unseated and would take on Kerber in the first round. And after demolishing her in the first set, Raducanu would win in straights 6-2, 6-1. In the second round, she'd take on Noskova, who had just demolished the number eight seed Ostapenko in the previous round. And after bageling in the first set, Raducanu would eventually win in straights Six love, seven five to get to the quarterfinals. Sviantek entered the tournament as the number one seed and would get a bye in the first round. In the second round, she'd take on Mertens, who had just taken out the wild card Tatiana Maria in three sets in the first round. And after trading a couple of breaks in each set, Sviantek would get through in straights, six three six four to advance to the quarterfinals. These two have played two times before, with Sviantek winning both matches in straight sets, but they did play it two years ago during the Sviantek streak, and Raducanu put up a good effort, getting a few games off Sviantek when others couldn't even get one game. So the way Raducanu's playing this week and the way she's been playing lately, she really could push Sviantek in this matchup. If Raducanu's gonna win this one, she needs to be aggressive and serve well. Her servers look so good over the last couple of days, and also last week in the Billie Jean King Cup, She's won both her matches this week in straight sets and in the Billie Jean King Cup, she did really good against France. So serving well and being aggressive is going to be key if she's any chance of getting a set or beating Sviantek. If Sviantek's going to win this one, she needs to make sure she takes the aggression to Raducanu. She also needs to serve well in this one. Even though it's on clay, serving doesn't matter that much for Sviantek, but she does get bullied around sometimes. And we saw that yesterday a little bit with Mertens. Mertens got a couple of breaks against Sviantek by being aggressive. And we know Raducanu at the moment is being really good and aggressive. So Sviantek's got to be careful with that. Be good defensively and also serve well. Fun matchup here. And I reckon this might be the closest one of them all out of the three they've played. But I've got to go with Sviantek in this one. Her on clay is just too good to miss. And I you just can't pick against her. Only the best players in the world over the last couple of years have beaten her. Raducanu maybe gets a set. I don't know. Three sets, Sviantek. But I reckon Sviantek wins this one and makes it the semis. But let me know down in the comments below who's making the semis. All right. So there it is. Winner of this plays, Rybakina. who got the win today uh, in a close three-setter against Paolini. And of course, you can see there, that's the roads to the quarterfinals for the other two. But um, yeah, very hype match. Of course it is. Because of course, uh, these are two of the most popular players on the tour. Emma Raducanu, 303 in the world. 21-year-old from Great Britain. She is 5'7 right-handed. Five wins, five losses on the year. Of course, her comeback season from getting double wrist surgery and I think ankle surgery last year. Was it double wrist and ankle? I think it was something like that. So she's trying to uh, recover. And you can see that her... Uh, she's only got the one title, of course, the US Open back in 2021. 20, but her form... I mean, she won a couple of matches the last few weeks, so it's been pretty decent. And the world number one, Igor Sviantek, 22 years old from Poland. She is 5'9", right-handed. 22 wins, three losses on the year. She has two titles this year, including Indian Wells being the biggest one of them all so far. 19 career titles. You can see that her form has been super solid. 2 0 is the head to head. First time they played two years ago was during the Sviantek streak when no one thought anyone could get a set of Sviantek on clay. And then Raducanu came in with a lot of criticism, of course. A lot of people not liking Raducanu because she was a one slam wonder, blah, blah, blah. And then, of course, um, Sviantek ends up uh, getting pushed unexpectedly against Raducanu in that one. So let's see. Raducanu has fancied that she can push Fiontek here and a lot of people think that it might happen. I hope uh, I hope we get a good match. I mean, the last two matches have been so epic. We need to, we need to continue this going. Every match today has a has an epic vibe. All right, here we go. Fiontek's going to serve first, by the way. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. No. Unbelievable. 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 Yeah, unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's unbelievable. I don't care about what I was saying. Eat him out. Finally, Von Drauseva playing like a top 10, still not good for number 8. Saba should figure out how to win again. She hasn't looked good since AO. Thank you for the uh, 8 bucks. Yeah, Vondi getting a top 10 win. I mean, that's 
hopefully, like, if Kostruk beats Goff, I hope Vondi makes the final. I want Vondi to make the final. Because Vondi, Vondi deserves another big final. 6-4, six, 6-4 four, six, four is a push. Well, if you remember back in the day, remember back two years ago when Sviantec was bagging everybody. So getting, there was a, in 2022, getting a, getting a, a close set was a win against Sviantec. I mean, chat, one in the chat if you remember that, those days. Like, everyone was losing 6-love, six 6-1. Six so then going 6-4, six 6-4 four, six four was close. Like, a lot of people, 6-4 was a win. <laughs> 2022, Sviantec, 6, yeah. 6-4, six 6-4 four, six four was a win. It was a, was a push. And that was when Rodokana wasn't winning any matches. So, still happens this to this day. Yeah, <laughs> true. These days, Sviantec does lose sets a little bit more. But, yeah, back then... Samsonova. Samsonova won after, got a set after that, though. Because remember how they played first and then Samsonova got a set off her the next day? Or the next match or whatever? But this was before Samsonova. So, like, Shriantic was bageling and breadsticking everyone. And most people thought it was going to be a double bagel because Rodokana was playing, like, terrible and Shriantic couldn't miss. And the bakery, yeah, the bakery was a grand opening in 2022, yeah. So then for um, Rodokana to get 4-4 four and four was super unexpected. And was actually decent, a pretty respectable result for the time. Has Emma ever even won a tournament after the US Open win? No, she has not. She is yet to win another title, but she will. Don't you worry. Okay, eager. Trying to win a third Porsche in a row. <laughs> Cam, have you seen the new Madrid trophy? Bit depressing in my opinion. Oh God, don't. What is it? What does it look like? I looked at this and I'm like, oh, this is awesome. That's a Valorant trophy. What's the new one look like? Oh, God. I can't see it. Send it to me on Twitter. Send it to me on Twitter. I thought it was this trophy, but this trophy is awesome. So it can't be that one. What is it? Is it a ball of metal? What is it? Oh, God. Now I'm nervous. Now I'm worried. They changed it again? Yeah, every year. I can't see it. What channel can I find the match? Uh, WTA TV. Uh, her last semifinal was Seoul, and she retired against Penko. Yeah. Yeah, send it to me on Twitter. I want to see this trophy. I want to see this trophy. It was a surfboard, and then it was twisted metal, and now it's a... Uh, what is it now? What does it look like? I need to know. <laughs> Wait, is this the trophy? Okay, I gotta be honest though. It kinda goes hard. It's kinda it's kinda good. It's my style. Like, I don't mind it. I think it's better than the other ones. But you are going to probably hate it. Chat, I don't know if you're going to like it. Thank you, Hadar, for sending it to me. Uh, and Jay. Uh, not going not gonna to lie. You're probably not going to like it, chat. But I, I, I like it. It's my style. I, I'm, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I like it. I don't mind. It's low. It's all right. I don't mind it. It's not bad. I get the string pattern and stuff. I get it. I get it. I kind of get it. I don't. I don't mind it. It looks like it looks heavy. It looks heavy. All right, who's gonna win this match, chat? I'm gonna go Shviantek in a close straight sets. I don't mind it. It looks like a black rock. It just looks like a rock with strings in it. But I, I don't mind it. I actually don't mind it. I, I think it's better. It's an improvement. <laughs> I think it's an improvement. It looks heavy. It, I could, it looks like... I could, it looks, yep, I don't mind it. All right, 15 love. Shriantec serving. She wins the first point here. As we serve down to the forehand of Rodokano. Forehand from Shriantec is into the open court. Rodokano with a slice. Goes short. And Shriantec hits a forehand. And Rodokano can't handle it. 30 love. I love it. Yeah, I don't mind it. I, I don't mind it. Unironically, do not mind. It, it could be worse. 
it isn't as bad as I expected. It's 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 different. All right, 30 love. Why do they keep changing it is what I want to know. Why can't we just have the same trophy every year? Why do they keep changing it? It looks like a cyber truck. Kind of does. So about why the Ford of Rotokana? Rotokana in the net. 40 love. It kind of looks like a cyber truck. <laughs> it's a cyber trophy. I don't mind it. I just wish they had the same trophy every year. Why are we making a new sculpture every year? Because then we then like all the photos are going to look like different tournaments. Every year, we're going to have the same trophy every year. At least Paris, even though it's ugly, still have the same trophy. Back in a foreign rally, Rodicano into the open court, slice from Fiance in the net. And it's 40-15. At least Paris with the um, with the spikes, at least it's consistent. They have it every single year. But uh, uh, chat. People are going to hate it. People are not going to like that one. I've reposted it, by the way, if you want to check it out. All right, 40-15. So don't see the backhand of Rodokanu. Backhand of Shviontek cross court. Rodokanu with the backhand. Again, the backhand of Shviontek into the form of Rodokanu. And Rodokanu puts an inside out forehand winner away. That's a good shot. 40-30. Nice from Rodokanu. 40-30. Forty thirty. As Shviontek serves. Out wide, the back of Rodokanu. Rodokanu with the return winner. This is going to be on things to you. Wow. Okay. Rodokanu's come out here with a couple of winners. Now we get the deuce. Get the deuce. Serve. Out wide, the form of Rodokanu. Return is another good return. Slash Fiontek goes long. Rodokanu is reading Fiontek's serve well. Advantage Rodokanu to break first game. Advantage Rodokanu. Advantage Rodokanu. Uh, Shviontek serves down the tee. Great serve. Return goes into the Fauna Shviontek. Rodokanu with the backhand down the line. Is a winner. She wrong foot Shviontek and breaks. From 40 love to break. Wow. Good start for Emma Rodokanu. She takes the break first game. By the way, Sidney Bass just started. We'll keep it on him as well. All right, break to start for Rodokanu. All right. Now we're going to watch that. Uh, we got golf coming up next. Why aren't we watching City Pass? Uh, hello? All right, Rodokanu serves. And the Polish fans make their voice heard. Rodokanu to serve. Now, Sviontek is known for slow starts. We all know that. At least I say that enough. And if I say it enough, it'll become true. Rodokanu serves. One love. First serve is a let. Rodokanu serves again. Serve goes in. The return from Shriante goes long, though. And it's 15 love. Yeah, love 40 to break. Brutal. All right, Rodokanu. She has the break. serve is a fault now she was serving really well yesterday against Noskova serve into the backhand of Shviontek return goes in the backhand of 
Rodokanu back on his fiance down the line. Rodokanu gets up with a slice. And the slice goes long. 15 all. And if Rodokanu beats the Queen of Clay, I'll join the fan base. Write their name down. You better. You reset it. Save the receipt, guys. Rodokanu fans, write that down. 15 all. Serve it wide, the fawn of Shviontek back in at Rodokanu into the fawn of Shviontek, who hits a long, and it's 30-15. 30-15. Shviontek overhitting that one. Rodokanu, by the way, does have a knee strapped. We talked about that the other day. All right, 30-15. 15 as Rodokanu serves again. Serving the Fornish Fiontech. Rodokanu with the backhand. The backhand Fiontech who hits it down the line and winner. Ooh. Wait, wait. This is going to be on Benny's TV, bro. 30 all. I think that was in. Yeah, it was in. On the line. That's in. Tennis. 30 all. As Rodokanu serves again. Served into the back of Shviontek. Back in at Rodokanu. Down the line to the fawn of Shviontek. Cross court. Into the fawn of Rodokanu. Shviontek with the fawn of the stretch. Rodokanu. Again to the fawn of Shviontek. Who hits it into the slice of Rodokanu. And Rodokanu hits it long. 30-40. Shviontek to break straight back. 30-40. Cam Cursed Eager will lose. Mods, ban that guy. Get him out of here. Not having my night ruined by negative chatters. 30-40. Uh, As we're back in return now from Shviontek, the backhand of Rodokanu. That's a great shot. Shviontek gets it with a slice. As Rodokanu hits a backhand again to the slice of Shviontek. Shviontek in the net. We're a deuce. Cam Cursed. Bam Cam Cursed. There's no such thing. You're a liar. Deuce. All right, Rodokanu survives. Had nothing to do with me. I said three sets anyway, so I mean, I don't, I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Deuce! Rodokanu serves down to see the back of Shriantek. Return goes in the back end of Rodokanu. That's a great shot. Shriantek with a passing shot. In the volley of Rodokanu, Shriantek with a slice. And Rodokanu backhand volley. Shriantek's going to get it, but it's double bounced. And Rodokanu gets advantage. To get to two love. Cam, you said two sets close to... Okay, well... Okay, wh whatever. Two sets? Okay. God. Thank you for watching all the videos so intensely. Thank you. Appreciate it. Advantage Rodokanu. First serve is a fault. Second serve... Second serve. Into the Fornish Fiancic return is good to the Fawn of Rodokanu. Rodokanu in the net. And it's back to Deuce. Alright, we get to Deuce. By the way, Rude won chat, which is great for the team. Rude's on 59 points. Bro can't miss! 59 points for Casper Root. He's a, he's a beast. He was cheap as well a couple, couple of months ago when I got him. He's on fire. Anyway, serve. Goes into the return from Shriantek. Fawn and Rodokanu. Shriantek goes down the line. Rodokanu can't get that. This is going to be on Benny's TV, bro. That's just smart. Tennis by the world number one. Advantage Shriantek. Hashtag Root spec. That's it. Hashtag Root spec indeed. Okay. Advantage Shriantek to take the break. And level this... Early days. Serve. Serve for Rodokanu. Here's a fault. Second serve. 
Second serve. Now wide the back of Sviantek. Backhand of Rodokanu into the backhand of Sviantek. Rodokanu with a slice on the stretch. Goes in. Sviantek backhand goes wide. And we're back to Deuce. Now we get back to Deuce. Sviantek unable to break this time. Okay. Rodikanu. With a serve. So don't see the backhand of Shviontek. Backhand of Rodikanu. Shviontek hits it in the ground. And it's advantage Rodikanu. Nice hitting from Rodikanu to start. Advantage to take the two love lead in this first set. All right. First serve is a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Out wide, the back of Shviantek return goes into the back of Rodokanu. Shviantek backhand. Again to the back of Rodokanu, which Shviontek gets backhand down the line. Rodokanu with the forehand on the stretch. Goes cross court. Shviontek cross court again. Into the forehand of Rodokanu. And Rodokanu hits it long. Back to Deuce. Deuce, Emma can get out of this, okay? Alright, Deuce. We get to deuce. Serve again. Serve Rodokanu. Out wide. The Fornish Fiancé return goes wide. Good serve. Advantage Rodokanu. To take the break. By the way, Rodokanu has, also has tape on her like thigh as well. That's probably just from playing a lot of tennis recently on clay. Not used to it yet. Please don't spam. Otherwise, I'll put slow mode on and then everyone will get angry. Advantage, Rodokanu. Serve is a fault. Second serve. Unfortunately, I can't speak French either. So try and keep things to English just so I can make sure that we're not all saying bad things. Advantage, Rodokanu. Serve out wide the back and his fiance. Back in at Rodokanu. Into the back of Shviontek is Rodikano. It's backhand cross court again, and that's wide. Back to Deuce. City pass was broken. No, oh, of course he was. Of course he did. Okay. Back to Deuce. 14 minutes played already. Holy moly. Deuce. Fifth deuce point as we get served down to the back of Shviontek. Return goes in the front of Rodokanu. Into the front of Shviontek who hits it in the net. That was a rush shot from Rodokanu. Advantage. Oh, sorry, from uh, Shviontek. Advantage Rodokanu. The weather is terrible in Munich. Luckily, we're not there. All right. Advantage Rodokanu. Uh, she serves. Great serve down the tee. Shviontek slices it back. And then Rodokano hits it out. Oof. <laughs> she had an easy forehand and she overhit it. Just got a little over aggressive. And we're back to Deuce. And Rodokano, that was a great serve. And Shviontek hit it off the top of the frame, it looked like. I mean, she probably should have hit a smash, but. She went with the forehand and it went out by a mile. All right. As what it kind of serves down the seat. Great serve. Shrons in the net. Cam, where are you from? I'm from Australia. All right, advantage Rodikanu. With the two love lead.
Serve into the form of Triantec. Back in a Rodokano goes wide. Back to Deuce. Back to Deuce! Yeah, this is a marathon already. He comes from a lamb down under. Yes. I do. Alright. Deuce! As... Rodokano serves. A fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the fourth Triantec. Return the back into Rodokano who hits in the net. Advantage Triantec. Do I like Vegemite sandwiches? I like Vegemite toasties. If anyone knows what they are. Alright, advantage. Shviontek to break. Has a bit of fault from Rodokanu. Second serve. What are toasties? Oh, um, I don't know. What do you call them? I don't know what do you call them. What are toasted cheese sandwiches in other places? Four to four and rally. As Rodokanu goes down the line, the back and Shviontek. Back and Rodokanu. Into the fauna, Shviontek. Cross court goes to the fauna, Rodokanu. Shviontek back and goes cross court. Rodokanu gets it. Shviontek down the line. As Rodokanu on the stretch, hits a cross court. Into the fauna, Shviontek goes down the line for a winner. What a shot from Eager. All right. It's 1 1 after 20 minutes. Toasty. Grilled cheese. A grilled cheese. A grilled cheese. That's what they call it. Grilled cheese. A Vegemite grilled cheese. Yes. They're good. I like those. Diaz Acosta is beating Sh City Pass. I think I said City Pass, and I didn't mean to say that. That was a slip of the tongue. City Pass. All right, 1 1. Break, break. 20 minutes. Who bought the popcorn? Shviontek serves. All right, Shviontek serves. Into the form of Rodokano. Return is great. Shviontek gets it with the slice. As Rodokano hits a backhand back behind uh, Shviontek. Great shot. And it's Love 15. Love 15. Love 15. As Shviontek serves again. Seven to the backhand of Rodokano. Return goes to Fauna Shviontek. Who hits a winner. That's a nice shot. 15-0. <laughs> who said quitsy pass? <laughs> You're savage. Mods! Laugh. 15-0. 15-0. 3,000 people in the house. What's up? Don't forget to sub. All right, Shviontek says a fault. Second serve. As we just serve. Down to see the back of Rodokanu. Fornax Shviontek goes cross court. Rodokanu gets it with a stretch forehand and hits it for a winner. Wow. This is going to be on Benny's TV, bro. Wow. 15-30. Lovely hitting. Nice hair, by the way, Cam. Thank you. Promote that. But can someone mod that guy? Okay, 15-30. Lovely forehand winner from Rodokanu. 15-30. Seven the backhand of Rodokanu. Rodokano hits it out. Good serve from Shviontek. And it's 30 all. By the way, Chad, anyone got any bets on this match? As with a serve. Uh, 
Serve out wide the ball. The forehand of Shri uh, Rodokanu. Forehand of Shri the back end of Rodokanu. Lob goes up. Shri with the high volley. It's not good enough. Rodokanu back in the rally. Forehand to forehand as Rodokanu flicks it. Long. Man, Rodokanu was back in that rally. Shri was in big trouble. 40 30. Forty thirty. And uh, Shriontek serves to take the lead. Grilled cheese sandwiches, yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll catch up. All right, forty thirty. Forty thirty. <laughs> Radikanu had the break, lost the break, hits it in the net, and it's 2 1 Sviantek in this set. All right, 2 1. Sviantek leads. Okay, how are we doing, chat? What's up? Will you answer my question? Can you answer my question, please? What is up? What is up? Turning point? Maybe. Somebody, somebody did say Sviantek's going to win 6 1. When she was down, one love. Uh, if Emma can't get her first serve in, then this uh, will be two sets for for sure. Okay. How has it been 22 minutes, only three games? I just logged on. Because Rodokano played a 15-minute service game in the uh, second game of the match. So Rodokano played a marathon. That's why it's taken forever. By the way, does Runa play today, chat? When does Runa play? Anyone know? I thought he played today. We need an Emma emoji back. Yeah, we need more members though. Otherwise, uh, YouTube only give us so many. Um, when does he play? He just won? Holy shit, he just won. Holger Runa. Holger Runa just won. Where? Yes! Oh, yes! Let's go! Straight sets, baby. All right. By the way, chat, our team is on fire. We have four players remaining and three of them into the semis. We just need Sviantek in and we're good. Sviantek, and we'll complete the set. Chat, it's our week. Did I just glitch? No, I'm here. Hello. One in the chat if I'm here. All right, Rodokan is serving. It's one... 2-1, uh, Sviantek with the break. Oh, with the lead, sorry. No break. Yeah, well, Team Tennis Talk is kicking ass today. The scouts, the scouting scouts need a raise. Yeah, the scouts at the back in the front office need a raise. I'll tell you what. There's a bit of forehand now from Rodokano into the forehand of Sviantek. Sviantek gets it out. And it's 15 love. I'll tell you what. I mean, Jabur and Trevison both got lots of points, which is fair. But, uh, yeah, bringing in Rabakina instead of Alcaraz. Goddamn. The recruiters are, uh, the, the, the scouts are awesome. Just got to somehow get uh, Collins in the mix, I think. Uh, there's been a fold out wide from Rodokano. Second serve. Second serve. Double fault. Check my salt thing there. 15 all. Who's in your team? So the the team is Sviantek, Rabakina, Rude, Runa, Jabur, Son Sonigo, Musetti, Trevison. And four of those players lost, but the other four are still winning. We also have Sinner, but he's uh, he's on the bench today. He's not playing. Back end goes in the back end of Sviantek. Back end out from Rodokanu. Into the back end of Sviantek as Rodokanu gets the point. Sviantek in the net. 30-15. So we've got Kazakina and Sinner to come back next week and play. Um, yeah, Runa winning. That's a big. That's huge. That's huge. That's a huge win. We needed that one. Keep Runa and Rude. Runa and Rude need a win. They need to win their draw. If they win their, their tournaments, we're going to be uh, looking pretty damn good. Return goes in from Sviantek in the four of Rodokano. Four and Sviantek down the line. Rodokano backhand. Into the back end of Sviantek, who overhits it, and it's 40 15. 
40-15. As Raducanu looks to take a leveling game. Serve. Into the back of Triantic. Return the back end of Raducanu. He shanks it wide. 40-30. Forty thirty. Uh, Forty thirty. And the county serves again. Into the Fornish Fiance, return the back of Rokano, which Fiance gets a backhand. Down the line and long, and it's 2-2. 2-2 uh, first set. Realistically, can Rodokano win another major? Opinions, yes. She can win one, she can win two. Um, all right. Okay. Here we go. 2-0. 30 minutes played. Shriantic serves. A fault. Second serve. Second serve. As the foreign return goes in, the foreign Rodokano shanks it wide. It's 15 love. Dean Love, nice hitting from Shviantek. 15 Love. Uh, Shviantek serves again. A fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the back end of Rodokano. Back end of Shviantek in the net. On the stretch. And it's 15 all. Uh, Cam, is your comment on Amira Andreva being, according to the bookies, one top favorite to win next Grand Slam? Wait, what? Uh, 15 all. Is served to the form of Rodokanu. Form of Shviantek into the form of Rodokanu. Uh, Shviantek is back in on the stretch. Rodokanu down the line. Shviantek's there with the forehand cross court and wide. It's 15-30. Rodokanu's bullying Shviantek here. 15-30. 15-30. serves again. Fifteen thirty. Uh, she serves. Down the tier, the forehand of Rodokano. Forehand of Shviantek. Into the forehand of Rodokano. Uh, Shviantek gets a forehand cross court. Rodokano gets it with the forehand in the line, but it's wide. 30 all. Nice hitting from both. 30 all here, Shviantek trying to stay in front. Thirty all. Thirty all as Shviantek serves down the tee. Rodokano slices it back into the back of Shviantek. Hits it down the line for a winner. Clutch. 40-30. Shviantek to stay in front. 
Shfiance serves. With the corner of Raducanu. Fornic, Shfiance cross court. Raducanu gets with the forehand cross court again to the front of Shfiante. Raducanu goes down the line. Shfiante backhand down the line again to the slice of Raducanu. And Raducanu is wide. 3 2. Shfiante leads in this first set. Okay. How are we doing, chat? That was a chair. Chair making weird noises again. Um, chat, where are you watching from? I haven't asked that today. Where are you watching from? Because today we got some new postcards. Look at the postcard wall, chat. Look at look. I put the wall. I put the postcards up. Look at that, chat. It's we're gonna get some more postcards down here though. We need a couple more down here, I think, because it's getting a little top heavy. But chat, look how good it looks. Bloody hell! Thank you to all the postcard senders. But, um, where are you guys watching from? Let me know in the chat. Where are you all watching from? And yes, that is a Wimbledon poster from the movie in 2004. I know you're asking. That was, yep, that's definitely a, that is the Wimbledon 2004 movie poster. Chat bought it. So we've got Norway, we've got Ethiopia, India, Dublin, Michigan, Chicago, uh, Turkey, Costa Rico, Philippines, we've got uh, India, Poland. Mexico, UK, UK, Sydney, UK, India, Sydney. We've got China, we've got uh, Sweden, Kuwait. We've got Manhattan in the chat as well. Melbourne, Scotland, Bangalore, Jamaica, Newcastle, Omaha, Alberta, Canada, Maryland, Greece, Nigeria, South London. Malaysia, we've got uh, Thailand, Sydney, South Africa, Dominican Republic, uh, we've got Edinburgh, we've got Cape Town, we've got West London, Eastbourne, Switzerland, Minneapolis, Australia, Essendon, really? You go for the Essendon Bombers? Uh, Great Britain, St. Martin, San Diego, Cape Town, Newcastle. Poland, Maldives, Sri Lanka, Polska, Barbados. We're going to return down to the front of uh, Rodokano. Back in a Sviantek. Down the line, Rodokano gets the front of Stretch. Goes cross court at the front of Sviantek. Rodokano goes again into the front of Sviantek. And Sviantek hits it wide. 15, love. Um, we've got California. Go the Dons. What a win today. What a great win today. We watched it on stream. Well, I was watching it while we were streaming earlier. And I was emotional. It was harsh. It was hard to watch. I'm mailing my postcard next week. It wasn't as easy as it sounded from California. That's all right, Kit. Appreciate the effort. Appreciate you going the extra mile to find a postcard and send it. Ace down the T, Rodicanu. Um, What you could do is you could always like... And look, I'd rather get postcards, but if you want to like be cheap about it, and that's fine. I, I, I love bargains. Um... You can always get a postcard of your hometown and, like, make one and then, like, print it off and send it, I guess. But the paper might get wrecked in the mail. So, like, cardboard is a little bit more safe than paper. But I guess if you wanted to, like, make a postcard, you could send it. I mean, if you want to go, like, you know, you don't want to go look for one. Back in a backhand rally. As Rodicano goes cross-court. 30, love. And Shriante goes backhand and backhand again. Down the line now from Shriante in the front of Rodicano. Slice goes into the backhand of uh, Shriante. Shriante smacks it down the line for a winner. 30-15. Like, you could make a postcard if you want. Um, but, uh, yeah, but it could get wrecked in the in the mail, though. So just, like, if it gets sent, well, I don't know if you can send a piece of paper in the mail <laughs> without it, like, in an envelope and stuff. Got a mail mine, too? Yeah. Send them through. We had a lot this week, which was cool. Six when I went to the post. That's the most we've had in one go. I haven't got any postcards from India, no. No Indian postcards yet. All right, 30 15. Is it a backhand to backhand rally? That's in the net from Rodicano. 30 all. Chance for Shriantek to break here and lead with that break. There you go. There's PO Box in the chat. Down the description below as well. All right, 30 all. Love to send one. Where do I send it? There's a PO Box in the chat. Thank you, uh, Mods. Thank you, Dawn. What's up, Dawn? How you doing? 30 all. As we just said about why the forehand of Shviante, uh, Rodicano backhand goes long. And Shviante gets the break point. 30-40. 30-40. 
I can make a photo of Ego in Warsaw and send it to you. Well, uh, preferably, uh, like, the city landmarks and stuff. Like, I want to know where you guys are watching from, not so much, like, who your favorite player is. But, I mean, if there's, I mean, if you're from Warsaw and you got a photo of Warsaw, that's great. That'd be awesome. All right, 30 40, break point for Sviantek, second serve. Second serve, Radicanu. Into the fourth, it was a double fault. That didn't look like a double fault. Shriantek hit in the net, so if this is in, it's going to be deuce. If it's out, it's a double fault, and the umpire is saying it's in. It was a good serve. It looked good, and Shriantek is saying that she lost. Well, she did lose the point. And Shriantek saying I got distracted by the call, and the umpire is like, "No, you didn't." I'm going to be honest, Shriantek kind of has a point because the call was made when she hit the ball, but Raducanu, like, the way Shriantek hit it, it looked like Raducanu's serve was too much anyway. So I I mean, the umpire might have been right on that one, and I hate saying that because we love to bash the umpires because, you know, sports. Um, but, yeah, I think the umpire was right there. She hit the ball in the net. The serve was good. All right, Deuce. Good save. That was a second serve. That could have been a double fault break. All right, second serve. Oh, this one's getting another challenge here. What's up? That was a fault. Umpire says it was out. All right, second serve. Second serve. Second serve. Rodokanu. Into the back of Shriantek. Back into Rodokanu. To the forehand of Shriantek. As Rodikano hits a forehand cross court. Shriantek's there with a forehand down the line. Great shot. Shriantek gets... Uh, sorry, Rodikano gets it with a lob. And Shriantek comes in with a swinging volley and overhits it. That was just unnecessary. Bad error from Eager. Advantage Rodikano. Well, she didn't need to hit that hard. But that was... That was an easy winner if she wanted to be. But she just decided to hit it too hard. Like, why did she hit it that hard? All right, advantage Rodikanu to take the uh, the game. Advantage Rodikanu to stay level. Serve into the fourth of Shriantek. Return the fourth of Rodikanu. Shriantek gets a point on the stretch. Rodikanu cross court again to the fourth of Shriantek. It goes down the line and wide, and there it is, three three. Rodikanu holds. Rodikanu holds. All right. Here we go. 3 all. Shviantek to serve. Shviantek with a serve. There's a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the back end of Rodokano. Return goes into the Fornish Fiontech. As Rodokano with a slice on the stretch, but it's in the net. And it's 15 love. By the way, chat. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the second channel. Uh, I went live early today on the second channel to play Topspin 4. The new Topspin game is coming out next week. And we'll probably play a little bit of that on the second channel. So... If you want to watch the second channel of the, the Top Spin 2K24, we'll play next week a little bit before Madrid on the second channel. So jump over there. As that goes out from Rodicano on the on the return, 30 love. 30 love. We're almost at 10,000 subscribers over there as well. So thank you for that. As the return goes in the fourth, Shriantek, and Shriantek puts it away. 40 love. 40 love. <laughs> 40 love.
Let me check. How close are we? We must. We we're almost at ten thousand subs over there. About two hundred and fifty away. So thank you for that. All right, serve. Into the backhand of Rodokano. Four nice Shriantek. The four to Rodokano is Shriantek. It's a forehand down the line. Rodokano with the backhand into the backhand. Shriantek. The backhand of Rodokano. And Shriantek. Back into backhand. Pardon me. As Rodokano goes down the line and long. No, it's yeah, it's long. Four three. Shriantek stays in front. In the first set here. All right. Yeah, subscribe to the second channel. We've got 9,744 people over there. So uh, sub to the second channel. One of the goals for my, me, my personal goals this year was to get to 10,000 subs on the second channel. So uh, we're getting there. Okay. All right. Also, we have video other videos on there as well, like tier lists and stuff. All right, four three. Emma playing well. Yeah, she is. She's making Fiance have to play very serious. I see some kind of rivalry here. Yeah, for sure. First clean game for Ego. Yeah, she got broken in the first one, and then that one was the easiest game she's had so far. Thank you to the two people that subscribe to the second channel. Appreciate it. You know who you are. All right. They're both dialed in. Yeah. Go Garcia. She playing? Roddy kind of an 8-1 favorite in the 8-1 uh, in the bookies literally no, gave her no chance. Yeah, I had like I was looking at the odds. The over was like 18 and a half, which could still happen, but um, I thought that was super low. What's that? 18 and a half is like three and three, right? Three and four? Then again, it's four, three. So what can I say? Maybe it's maybe it is going to be three and four. Where's the second channel? Uh, link in the chat somewhere. Go watch me play uh, Top Spin 4. <laughs> I won. Uh, spoiler alert. But uh, it was fun. It was good. It was a nice chill stream. By the way, City Bass lost the first set. <laughs> Of course he did. All right, four now. Turns into a smash. Fiance goes to the back of Rodicano and Rodicano in the net. Love 15. I spoke way too soon. Love 15. Winner of this place. We're back in it, by the way. Love 15. Love 15 is... Rodicano serves again. Now, while the back of Shvianzik return goes long, and it's 15 0. Fifteen all. Fifteen all is. Rodakanu serves again. In the fourth Shvianzik, Forno Rodakanu is back behind Shvianzik. Nice. Top spin stream was fun. Yeah. Yeah, it was chill. All right, 30 15. Rodicano serves again. Is this court smaller than others? Now, nah, all the courts are the same. It's just that the back of the court's way bigger here, so it does look smaller. Because there's like so much room behind the baseline, which usually it doesn't have that, but that's because they're playing in like a multi-purpose arena. But uh, yeah, it looks like a way smaller court because the back of the court's massive. Back in the backhand as Shriante gets a forehand cross court, Rodicano gets on the stretch. Uh, Shriante gets a forehand in to the back of Rodicano. Again, the forehand of Shriante. As Rodicano's backhand cross court goes to the back of Shriante. Into the back of Rodicano. Down the line of the forehand of Shriante on the stretch. Rodicano, forehand into the back of Shriante. It's a wide and it's 40-15. 40-15. Hey, Rowdy, thank you for the super chat. Mate, I don't know why your super chats don't come through. Um, but thank you for the five. Rowdy kind of with a little fist bump there as well. Forty fifteen. 
As Rodikano looks to level this up at 4-4. Serve to the back end of Sriantec, but Rodikano hits a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Yeah, I'll read it. I'll get there in a second. Hang on. <laughs> I'll get there after this game. 4 to 15. Serve to the four end of Sriantec. Sriantec in the net. 4 4. Okay, now I'll read it. Thank you, Rowdy, for the five. Uh, that's how you know. That they are diehard Tennis Talk fans. They watch you play video games. Only kidding, bro. Uh, you know that I'm me, myself, Mr. Sarkasm. That's all right. I know you're joking, Brady. Okay, 4-4. Four, four. Yeah, thank you, everybody, who watched uh, me play video games. It was fun. It was nice. It was, like, relaxing. Just to sit there and relax and, you know. I didn't yell as much. So that was good. I didn't shout as much. All right, Rowdy probably blocked the super chat. I don't think Rowdy, I don't think he can do that. It just didn't come through. I don't know. Super chat's been on and off. Like some people's come through, some don't. Super stickers don't come through for some reason. I don't know what's going on. YouTube's been weird. Ah, right, four four. Which player were you? Uh, I was a custom player. As we're back on return now, the backhand is Shriantek. Four now from Rodokanu. Into the fourth is To the backhand of Rodokanu. Shriantek gets backhand cross court. Rodokanu on the stretch with a slice. Into the fourth is Shriantek. Rodokanu goes down the middle. Shriantek forehand cross court's a winner. Too good. 15 love. Okay. 15 love. Shriantek serves again. I only block Nightbot. <laughs> yeah, Nightbot's annoying. Uh, first serve's a foul. Second serve. Second serve. Down to the back end of Rodokanu. Back and out goes long from Rodokanu. And it's 30 love. So there's the second channel. If you want to check it out. More videos coming soon. As Shriantek serves. Now why the Fauna Rodokano return goes in the Fauna Shriantek. Rodokano forehand. Cross court, the Fauna Shriantek, who hits it down the line of the backhand of Rodokano with a stretch. A Shriantek backhand, cross court. Shriantek now with a backhand. Down, uh, cross court again, back behind Rodokano, smart. 40 love. Shriantek to take back the lead. Stop spamming. Yeah, mod spam me. All right. 40 love. Shriantek take to take a 5-4 lead in this first set. Serve is a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Now why the backhand of Rodokanu? Back in Shriantek take again, the back of Rodokanu with a slice. Goes in. Shriantek down the line. Winner. Too good. Shriantek looking real, real sharp now. 5-4. Five, 5-4. Four. Five, four. All right. How are we doing, chap? That's the wrong one. Will you answer my question? Can you answer my question, please? All right. 5-4. Um, I don't know why my the chest are coming up on my screen, my other screen. Um, all right, what's going on? Rodikano has, has stopped being aggressive and Iga isn't giving her the chance. True. Uh, Shri Shriantek is get not giving her the chance. Whereas to start at the start of the match, Rodikano was was able to dominate the baseline, but Shriantek's gotten, again, the slow start, you know, the Shriantek slow start, it happens. 
Okay. Uh, this is true test of character now. Okay. I agree. Emma needs more depth. Look, if, if Radicano still wins this set from now, I mean, this is where Shriantek usually breaks and wins, right? That would be a hell of an effort. Eager accelerating 100 weeks in world number one next week. Nice. Where does that put an all-time list? Where does she? Where is she on the all-time list? Currently, is that top? No, not top ten. Yeah, top ten. She's currently number nine. Most weeks of world number one, number nine. Wow, that's quick. She's gonna she's gonna overtake Barty this year. That's quick. Chad, how many times have I said Shviontek special? Like, give me a number. How many times have I said it? Like a million? Like 20? 70, 75? So 99 weeks. She overtakes Lindsay Davenport to go to number nine. Justin Enden's at 117. You got Barty at 121. Monica Sellers at 178. And then uh, Hingis at 209. Hingis is the number five. So if you get to 200... She's going to start looking down that top five. That's huge. That's huge. Fiontech's so special. 800 times? Yeah. Two million. No, not two million. She is so special. But yeah, top 10 most weeks at world number one all time. That's, I mean, that's where she is. She's already a Hall of Famer, and she is uh, continuing to impress. All right, so don't see the form of Fiontech. Rodicano kind of gets it. Love 15 here is... She wants to get another winner. This is too easy. Unbelievable. And it's Love 30. Shviontek trying to take this first set. All right. Love 30. Love 30. <laughs> savage. Dutchie is a savage. Love 30. <laughs> Love 30. Backhand return. The backhand of Rodokanu. Backhand now from Shriantek. Like the forehand of Rodokanu. Again, the forehand of Rodokanu. Uh, what? I don't know. But forehand goes long from Shriantek. 1530. Bloody hell. Okay. Fifteen thirty. There's still a chance here for Shviontek to get the break and take this first set. As Rodikanu serves. Serve out wide as a fault. Second serve. <laughs> Me too, Dawn. I feel that. As we serve out wide. Oh, massive serve. Rodokanu. It might be a double fault, though. Huh? Shriantek reckons it's wide. The umpire's going to check. If this is in, it's a great serve. It's out. It's a double fault. The umpire says that it's in. The umpire says... Oh, Shriantek says it might not be in, but the umpire is saying it's in. Shriantek's like there's... Yeah, the umpire's saying... I can't... We can't see it. All right, that was a great second serve. 30 all. 30 all. Thirty all as Roddy kind of serves again. Into the back of Shriantek. Return goes into the front of Rodicano. Shriantek with the forehand again to the front of Rodicano. Goes down the line. Great shot. Shriantek can't get it. 40-30. And the crowd go wild. 40-30. Forty thirty. Nice hitting there from Rodicanu. Forty thirty. As we're serving the back end of Shriantek, back end of Rodicanu is a winner. Whoa. Come on. Woo. Okay, five five. Five five. That was clean by Rodicanu. 
Five all. Huge hold, yeah. And a big shout from Rodokano as well. You know it means something. Five five. Can you tell us where you're watching it? I'm watching it on WTA TV. Uh, as we just serve now. Into the forehand of Rodokano. Short return into the forehand of Triantic. Rodokano with the backhand pass. Triantic volleys away. 15 love. Fifteen lovers. Well, he kind of almost stumbles there. When's Kogo playing? Straight after this. Straight after this. As the return goes into the Fornish Fiontek and Fiontek smacks it away. Jesus. Fiontek, just stop it. Thirty love. 30 love. Another serve coming up. 30 love. 36 serves. Into the back of the Return Return goes in the front of Shriantic on the stretch, and Shriantic is in there. In the little bit. 30 15. Thirty fifteen. Serve again. Nearly an hour played. So don't see the Fauna Rodicano return is in. Shriantic goes cross court the Fauna Rodicano. Again to the Fauna of Shriantic. Rodicano backhand. Again to the Fauna of Shriantic. Rodicano with a slice. Goes in. Shrianza goes down the line again. Rodokano's backhand goes cross court and wide. 40 15. To take the lead again. <laughs> Tiebreak loading? I hope so. That'd be awesome. We haven't had a tiebreak yet. We've had a couple of the 7 5s. What time is it for you? <laughs> Late. Early. 40 15. Serve to the backhand of Rodokano, but it's a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the backhand of Rodokano. Four and now from Shriantic inside. That's a win up. It's 5 6 5. Shriantic holds. Stays in front. All right. 6 5 first set. Emma is top 10 if that body holds up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shviant, uh, Radakanu, if she gets back in the top 50, that's an achievement. That's a win. Top 10, I mean, we're talking like that's, that's a lot. That's a whole other thing. You gotta win 1,000 titles to get in the top 10 these days. You gotta be Grand Slam finalist, quarterfinals, semifinals. So I think if you're a Rodokanu fan, you're talking like top 100. Once she gets back there, then you go top 50. And then like maybe seated at a slam. Like top 10 is like way too far away. It's like saying Shriantek is the GOAT. She's gonna beat Serena. Like that's way too far away. Let's wait till she gets to 10 and then we'll talk about it. You know? Like just trust me, pace yourselves. She's only 21. She's got 10 years. Minimum. You know, if she's healthy. Don't worry about it. Just slowly get back. Pushing Shriantek to a tiebreak is a good start on clay. Because Shriantek on clay is a beast, right? So this is a good start. Top five? All right, you're ridiculous. Sub uh, just come on. Um, FAA is not winning, okay? She did win a slam, but also she hasn't got one now. You don't, you don't keep the points forever. All right, Rodokano trying to get to a tie break in this first set. 6-5. Rodokano to serve. Tie break loading, maybe. 
Future world number one. All right, now we get crazy. All right, run a car to serve. Some of you drinking too much Kool Aid. What are Sky Sports Ten is talking about? <laughs> what are they giving? What are they, what are they giving you, chat? Well, like, what are they giving you? What is Laura Robinson giving you? Don't drink the Kool Aid. Just, just, just watch the tennis. Enjoy, right? Fifteen love. What's Tim Hemman telling you? What's up? <laughs> Fifteen love. What's he giving you? What's he doing? Hey. Don't accept the drinks, all right? Fifteen love. Buy your own drinks. <laughs> As we serve, out wide the back of Shriantek. Shriantek gets it out. Thirty love. 30 love. Rodokanu trying to get to the tie break here. 30 love. There's Rodokanu serves. Into the back of Triantek. Forehand Rodokanu. Into the forehand of Triantek on the stretch. Rodokanu. Forehand cross court behind Triantek. Great shot. Triantek was going the wrong way. 40 love. To take us to a tie break in this first set. 40 love. Forty love. As Rodokano serves. Out wide, she feels like returns it short. Rodokano puts it away. Tie break. All right. Who's winning the tiebreak chat? Okay. 9 7 Triantec. We got 9 7 Emma. Tiebreak. That's it. 7 5 Emma. We got 7 3 Eager. 7 4 Eager. 7 4 Eager. 8 6 Triantec. 7 5 Rodokanu. We got Rodokanu. Triantec, Rodokanu, Rodokanu. A lot of Rodokanus. Jesus. Hello, Shriantic fans. Are you here? Hello? Where are the eager fans? Serve at the backhand of Rodokano. Find a Shriantic down the line. It's Rodokano to the backhand of the net. It's one love Shriantic. One love Shriantic. By the way, you can cash the over. Chat, it was 18 and a half. I mean, how did you not take it? Cash the over. All right, one love. Shriantek with a mini break. Serve out wide is a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Second serve. The back of Shriantek. Back in at Rodokanu. Into the back of Shriantek. Rodokanu with the back and slice on the stretch. Into the four and swinging volley, and Shriantek puts it away. One, a uh, two zero mini break. Unbelievable. All right. Two love Shriantek with the break. Two love Shriantek. Rodokano serves. Into the back of Shriantek. Return goes back into Rodokano. Shriantek backhand. Down the line winner. Woo! This is going to be on Venice TV, bro. Woo! Okay. Three love Shriantek. Double mini break. What a shot. What a shot. All right. That was clean. Three love. Just back it as sweet down the line. Don't put scores in the chat. Three love. Double mini break. As Shviontek serves. Shviontek with a serve. Down the tee. Great serve. Return goes into the form of Shviontek. It puts it away. Four love. Champ time. Yeah. It's, uh, yeah. The Queen of Clay is here. The Queen of Clay is definitely here. Okay. For love. 
Champ champ time? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, full love. Serve that water's fault. Second serve. Second serve. Second serve, the return goes to the back of Shriante, who hits it into the slice of Rodokanu. Shriante comes in with a swinging volley. Rodokanu's there with a forehand. She pushes it down the line. It goes in. Back of Shriante is wide. Awkward defense, but effective from Rodokanu. 4-1, she's on the board. Shriante leads. All right. 4-1. Shriante just dragging that one wide. 4-1 Triantec. As Rodokanu serves. Served on the seat of the Fauna Fauna Rodokanu inside out. It's a great shot, is it? No. That looked in. It's 5-1. The umpire's not even going to check. The umpire's not even leaving the chair. It looked close, but obviously the umpire's saying no. 5-1, they change ends. That looked close. No. Umpire said no. 5-1, they change ends. Why does Emma's ranking so low? That was the chair. Um, because she hasn't played. Is that by a mile? No, no, it looked close. Maybe because I saw... It looked like the line... It looked like it cleaned the line, but it must have cleaned the back of the line. Like the back, the outside of the line. Why don't they use camera zoom? Because, uh... I don't know. Because they, they spent all the money on the Porsche. So they have, didn't have time for Hawkeye. They didn't have Hawkeye in the budget. They're like, we need three cars? What about Hawkeye? Nah. Let's get the cars. And we'll, if we have money left for Hawkeye, we'll get it. No, we don't have money left. Okay, don't worry about it. 5-1. Return goes in the form of Rodokanu. Rodokanu puts it away. 5-2. Shviontek with a chance to take the set here. It's also on clay, yeah. <laughs> but Hawkeye on clay can still be effective. Alright, 5-2. Yeah, Hawkeye on all men's matches next year except for RG and Wimbledon. Yep, that's happening next year on the men's side. The lady side will follow. They'll they'll do, they will they will do all Hawkeye soon enough. Is it a four down line into the slice of Rodicanu? Four down from Shviontek is a winner. Six two. Most of the tournament combined events will be Hawkeye for everybody anyway. So most of the WTA pl t uh, tournaments like Indian Wells, Miami, Madrid, Rome, they'll all have Hawkeye. I think they already have Hawkeye anyway, don't they? Like as in automatic line calls. So all right, Shviontek six two. Uh, four set points to take the first set. Serve. Into the Fort of Rodokano return. Goes out. There's a set. Competitive set, which is very good for Rodokano. I mean, it shows how, how good she's been playing the last couple of weeks, but there's a reason why Shviontek's won three out of the last four French Opens and two of these titles in a row. Over an hour played. Shviontek takes the first 7-6. All right. But competitive. Competitive. All right. Much harder for Eager than I expected. Yeah. Yeah, Emma has improved. She has improved. I said 7-2. Nice. Congrats. You win. You are the winner. Uh, this is against Eager on clay. Not too bad, for sure. What about... Imagine this on uh, on grass at Wimbledon. That would be interesting. <laughs> that could be fun. Will Emma now be blown away in the second with a breadstick? I reckon Shviontek will start to... I think Shviontek might... I don't think breadstick, but I think Shviontek might start uh, unleashing some fury. She does do that to a lot of players in the second sets of matches. Sabalenka lost, allow Iga B number one until US Open. Is that real? Is that like a... Are you just saying that? 
Is that an actual stat? Is that confirmed? Because that's kind of crazy. Because US opens ages away. Uh, do you think Emery is getting back in top 10? Like I said, don't spam. Um, is grass Emma's best surface? No, nah, I think hard court. Hard court's her best. How many sets Eager lost in Stuttgart this this week? Uh, zero. In her whole career, she lost one to Samson over. I don't think she lost one last year. Let me check. Um, she has uh, lost two sets at this tournament. She's not lost a match. She's nine and zero at this event. Uh, it is a pretty hard event to get into. So she only, she only played this event as world number one. So she didn't play in 2021 because she wasn't ranked high enough. But um, yeah, she hasn't lost a set. She's beaten Sabalenka twice. She's beaten Raducanu once. Jabir, Pliskova, Zhang. Uh, Samson over got a set off her. Uh, and also, so did uh, Pliskova last year. Got a, won the first set in the quarterfinals. So yeah, only one set she's lost. The two sets she's lost at this event. But um, yeah. But she's gonna have to play Rabakina tomorrow. That's, and I know everyone's gonna say, but Cam, she beat Rabakina in Doha. Everything's fine. She beats Rabakina now. She doesn't lose to Rabakina anymore. That that happened before, and it doesn't happen again. No. Rabakina in the semis is dangerous. Like, that is not an easy match. <laughs> that is not... Just because she won one match does not mean that Rabakina is going to be an easy win tomorrow. Like, what are you talking about? So, and Rabakina's... I mean, Rabakina's... Still won a lot. Rodokana, by the way, waiting for uh, Shvansi to come back in the bathroom. That must be a hell of a match if we get it. She's invincible in Germany. Still got and bag on, bad on Berg. Well, she retired in Badenberg one last year, so I, don't, I mean, undefeated, but also didn't win the title. So, eager on clay is unbeatable. Well, yeah, well, that's what I, I mean. They played in Rome last year, and Triantec was injured, so that wasn't a fair comparison. But I really want, I really can't wait for uh, Rebecca versus Triantec, especially because when they played in Doha, it was super windy and the weather was shitty. So tomorrow, the weather's going to be perfect. It's going to be on a court that Sviantec wins a lot on. Rabakina, Rabakina can play. Like, she hasn't played great this week, but it's going to be, uh, it is going to be interesting tomorrow if, if we get Sviantec Rabakina because Rabakina, I feel like might be out for revenge because she didn't play well against her last time. Back in a return now from Sviantec in the back end of uh, Raducanu. Back in a Sviantec down the line. Raducanu with a slice as Sviantec hits it back in inside out. Raducanu's there with a slice again. As we get another forehand, a backhand to the forehand of Rodokanu. Backhand to Sviantec is a winner. Jesus. All right. Love 15. No messing about. I just feel like Rodokanu is better on grass and eager on clay and hard courts go either way. Maybe. I don't know. I, I, does anyone else feel like Rodokanu might just turn it on tomorrow? I don't know. I think she wants to get back against Sviantec. I would not be shocked if that match ends up being... If we get that match, if it ends up being, um, if we're back and it wins it, because I think she'll be wanna, she'll wanna get get that loss back. It wasn't a great match from Rebecca a couple couple of weeks ago, but the tie break was shocking. She played so bad, like she nearly won the first set, and the wind was terrible, and she just couldn't play. And as that goes wide from Rodokanu, love thirty. All right, love 30. Uh, is Rodikanu in trouble here? Love 30. She serves. A fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the forehand of Sviantec. Forehand of Rodokanu. Into the forehand of Sviantec. Goes in line with the back end of Rodokanu on the stretch. Sviantec. Inside out. The back end of Rodokanu. And Rodokanu puts in the net. 
Love 40. So it's clear that who Cam is picking for the semifinal predictions. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you know me so well. All right, Love 40. Chance for the break straight away. Shviontek in the second. Love 40. Uh, that's a bit of serve. To the back of the Shriantek. Down the line's a winner. Too easy. One love. There's the break. One love. One zero. One zero. Okay. First set, by the way, 18 winners and 11 errors from Sviantek. 13 winners and 6 errors from Rodikanu. One break each. Both serving pretty well. <clears throat> pretty well. But um, Sviantek clutching the tie break, and that's all that mattered. All right. Back to Sviantek. She's got the set and the break. Well, City Pass won the second set. Nice. Well, Coco Goff after this, by the way. Stay tuned. Goff versus Kostuk. We saw it at the Australian Open. It was a terrible match, uh, but it was close. So that's all we can ask for. It was close. It was fun. It was fine. All right. Rodokanu missing the approach, and it's 15 love. 15 love. Shviontek serves again. Fifteen love. There's been a fault from Rodikanu. Sec uh, sorry, from uh, Shviontek. Second serve. Second serve. Fifteen love. With the back end of Rodokano. Great return. This is going to be on Tennis TV, bro. And it's 15 all. Massive backhand return from Rodokano. 15 all. Fifteen all is Shriantek serves again. Into the Fauna Rodokanu. Fauna Shriantek down the line as Rodokanu hits back into the stretch. Shriantek goes down the line. Rodokanu cross quarters. Shriantek hits it down the line for a winner. 30 15. Come on! Hey, Rowdy. Thank you for the 20. Bloody hell. Thank you for the 20, Rowdy. Jesus, mate. Uh, can you let members only Discord members have a music section? I hope that so we with so many people from. So many different countries, we can have different types of music that we all share. Is there not a music section? I thought there was one. 3015. Thank you for the 20, Rowdy. Bloody hell, mate. All right, 3015. That's going to serve into the back end of Rodokanu. Back end of Shriantek. Into the fort of Rodokanu as Shriantek gets the fort of the stretch in the net. 30 all. Chance to get the break back. 30 all. 30 all. Yeah, there's a music section there, Rowdy. You've been putting music in there already. <laughs> We've already got a music section. Uh, 30 all. Is it a serve now? The forehand of Rodokanu. Forehand of Shriante cross court. Rodokanu gets it with the forehand down the line as Shriante's backhand goes again. The forehand of Rodokanu. Into the back of Shviontek, Rodokanu. Forehand cross court goes wide, and it's 40-30. I'm still looking for my Nickelback. That's funny. Unironically, Nickelback does have some uh, bangers. 
Oh, we have a mu yeah. In the in the members only Discord, we have a music section. You can put music from like just put, you can post links and stuff in there. So if you want to share your favorite songs, you can chuck it in there. All right. 40-30. Serving the back of the kind of return the net. Two love. Two love, Shriantek. Two love, Shriantek. In the second. She won the first in the tiebreak. All right. Two love. Back to Rodokanu. Okay. Serve. Down the tee is a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the back end of Shriantek. Four now Rodokanu. Inside out of the back of Shriantek as Rodokanu to forehand. Cross court. Shriantek on the stretch with Rodokanu goes down the line. It falls down. Rodokanu goes down. She's all right. Just a bit uh, clay all over her, which it's a problem with falling on clay is that it's it's dusty. It's dirty. And Shriantek says, you're right. She's all right. She's just covered in clay. It was a weird fall. It was like a. It was kind of a slip. Yeah, she kind of. She nearly rolled her ankle. That could have been really bad. She went to slide, and her foot kind of got stuck. A little bit like Zvera, but not as extreme. Obviously, she went. She rolled with it. And she's back on her feet. Love fifteen. Love 15. All right, love 15 is going to serve again. Here's a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Into the back of Shriantek. Return goes back into Rodokanu. And Shriantek gets a forehand inside out. But it's long. 15 all. Alright, 15 all. Alright, 15 all. As Rodokanu serves in the back of Triantek, return goes in the back of Rodokanu, who hits it down the line. Triantek there with a slice, but Rodokanu's ball went wide. And the umpire's going to check. It was close. And it was good. So the umpire got it wrong again. Lines people on fire. We're going to replay the point 15 0. Fifteen all. Rodokanu, by the way, is covered in dirt still, but Rodokanu is asking whether or not Shriantek, uh hit the ball out or not. And she should have won the point, but uh, Rodokanu is going to have to replay the point because Shriantek hit the return in. All right, 15 all. As Rodokanu serves down the tee, that's a fault. Second serve. Second serve. Second serve into the back end of Shriantek. Back end of Rodokanu. Again to the back end of Shriantek as Rodokanu hits the back end down the line. Shriantek's there with a four on the stretch. He hit the tape and goes over. Rodokanu's not going to run for that. Shriantek says sorry. 15 30. All right, 15 30. By the way, somebody asked about brackets. We have a bracket group uh, on this website. If you want to go use it, you can join it. Um, so if you want to do a bracket, you can. 
Jump in there. Sign up. We're almost at 600 uh, members in there, so you can go do it. Go sign up for a bracket there. I will make uh, a fan slam for the um, for Madrid if they uh, let us. <laughs> 15.30 here. Hey, Rowdy. Thank you for the two bucks. Let them know that it's in the members only Discord. Yeah. So members in the Discord. In the members only Discord, there's a music section. Rowdy wants you to join. By the way, Rowdy, you can write in the Discord. Just write in the, write in the main channel and just say, hey, check out the music channel. Like, you can do that too. You don't need me to say it. As that goes down the line for a winner there from Rodicano, 30 old. Like, if you write in the, just write in the, um, just go to like the, the main part and just say, hey, everybody, I'm here. Come hang out. I'm sure a lot, I saw a few people join. Can I buy rackets from you? No, I don't sell rackets. 30 old. Rodicano trying to get on the board here far, uh, in the second set. Served and see the back of Shriantek back into Rodicano. Into the Fornish Shriantek as Rodicano gets a forehand cross court. Shriantek's there with the forehand down the line. Rodicano gets it with the backhand into the Fornish Shriantek. Again to the backhand of Rodicano. And Shriantek's backhand goes again to the slice of Rodicano. Shriantek cross court winner. 30 40. But you can write in the Discord, Rowdy. Go for it. All right. 30 40. To get the double break. What's up, Robert? How you doing? 30-40. But Akanu right, needs to serve. 30-40. Serve it wide. The back of the field. Return goes wide. That's a serve. And we get to deuce. Unbelievable. Get to deuce. And there's a bit of serve again from Rodokanu. First serve is a fault from Rodokanu. Second serve. Second serve. Now wide the front of Shriontek. Return goes in the front of Rodokanu. Down the line at the back of Shriontek. Who hits a winner down the line. Back behind Rodokanu. And it's advantage Shriontek. Advantage Shriontek to take. To take a double break here. Advantage for on tech. Rodokanu serves out wide. The back of Shri on tech return the forward of Rodokanu. Shri on tech with a slice, but can't get it. Nice hitting Rodokanu. Back to Deuce. Come on! All right, we get back to Deuce. Lovely hitting. All right, Deuce. Rodokanu serves again. There's a bit of fault from Rodokanu. Second serve. Second serve. Into the back end of Shriantek. Back end of Rodokanu. The back end of Shriantek is Rodokanu's forehand. Goes again to the back of Shriantek of the stretch. Rodokanu, forehand cross caught. Shriantek's there with the forehand of the stretch. Rodokanu, drop shot. Oh, what a drop shot. This is going to be on tennis TV. Bro. Lovely from Rodokanu. And she gets to advantage. To get on the board in the second. Lovely drop shot winner. Under a lot of pressure as well. Advantage Rodokanu. All right. Advantage Rodokanu. Served in a tee, the four hundred Shriantek. Shriantek Shriantek gets it out. Rodokano holds. 2-1. 2-1 in the second. Shriantek has the break, though. She has the break. 2-1. Um, but Emma's on the board. How are we doing, chat? 
All right. How we doing? Struff is serving for the first set against FAA. Fair enough. Struff low key a beast on uh, on clay though. The wind predictor is fumbling. What do you mean? Emma will figure out eager on clay. Okay. I don't think so. I mean, I don't know so. You sound pretty sure. I was away from screen for a second and Rodokanu all covered in clay. She fell over. She got... Uh, she kind of tripped and, uh, and rolled. But she didn't hurt herself, which is good. This is a great match. Yeah, all, all, the whole day today has been awesome. It's been an awesome day of tennis so far. Uh, Emma might not be in top form right now, but she'll get there. Yeah, again, it, it all comes down to how she how she plays. You know, like uh, sorry, how she um how her body holds up because that's always been. It seems over the last few years, it's been the problem, right? She's she's definitely on her best day. She can beat everybody. Otherwise, she wouldn't have won the U.S. Open. But um, as long as she can be healthy, that's she's gonna and play like this more often. She's gonna get titles. She's gonna win. She's going to beat top 10 players. I mean, the, the the matches that she's played this week have been great. I mean, she bageled Serena. And more impressively, she bageled Azarenka. You know, like last year or two years ago. So, I mean, Raducanu, at her best, can beat everybody. She pushed Fiontek to, you know, she's this match is closer than the last time they played on clay. So, again, little steps, you know. Felix lost the first set. Ugh. As a return out of the back of Shriontek, back in at Raducanu in the net. 15 love. Shriontek has won this twice in a row. Two times. It's not too bad. Not Jay! Hey, Cam. Hey. With Arena losing, it's really opened the rankings up. If you go to Live Rankings and click 5 WWTA rankings, it shows that Coco can be number 2 at RG if she wins a good amount of matches because Coco doesn't have much to defend, unlike Sabo. I'm so excited. Thank you, Jay, for the two. Yeah. Um, yeah, we said that yesterday. We were talking about that yesterday. How somebody said, oh, can uh, Sabalenka beat, like, overtake Shriontek? It's. It was more that Shriante, uh, Sabalenka has to try and stay number two. <laughs> like, that's the that's what she's got to do. Goff could be number two as early as next week, right? Or, or like, in two weeks, right? And Shriante gets a 30 love. Like, if, Shriante, if, if Goff plays well in Madrid and Sabalenka does not, they could change. Because Sabalenka has to defend Madrid. Uh, if I have a look at what's going on with the live ranking. So, yeah, if... If they both lose next week at the same time, at the same round, Goff will overtake Sabalenka. Because Sabalenka's got a thousand points. So, yeah, Goff could be number two in the world after Madrid. As early as Rome, I should say. 40 love. She's going to take for a 3 1 lead in the second. It's kind of crazy. I mean, Goff hasn't done. I mean, she made the semis of the Australian Open, but other than that, hasn't done much this year. Other than the slam semifinals, but yeah, Sabalenka after losing uh, today really puts herself in trouble, rankings wise. And Goff at number two would be kind of cool going to the French. She'll avoid Chiantic to the final. I mean, she made a final, you know, before. As that goes to the net from Raducanu, and it's three-one. Sabalenka Chiantic semifinal. <laughs> I mean, come on now. Rabakina, wait. So wait, could we get... No, we couldn't get Rabakina because Rabakina is number four. So I was going to say, could we get Rabakina, Sabalenka, Shviontek in the same half? But no. It would make it Rabakina, Goff half, right? There's been 10 breaks in the Sarundalo match. That's terrible. <laughs> that sounds shocking. Okay. Rodokanu. Down to set and a break. And she serves. Into the back of Shviontek. Back into Rodokanu. Down the line to the Fornish Shviontek. As Rodokanu hits it cross court again to the Fornish Shviontek. Shviontek hits it out. 15 love. So 
15 love. As uh, Rodicani serves again. A fault. Second serve. Oh, me. Second serve. Into the back and Shriante return is down the line for a winner. And it's 15 0. This is going to be on Venice TV, bro. Lovely shot off the line. 15 0. Going to serve again. Rikanu serves 15 all. Serves a fault. Second serve. Second serve. The back of Shriantek. Back into Rodakanu. Into the back of Shriantek. Down the line's good to the front of Rodakanu who hits it to the front of Shriantek. Rodakanu back on the stretch with a lob. In comes Shriantek. Rodakani gets there with the backhand lob again. That's a great shot. Oh, it just goes out, though. Good effort on the lob, but it's 15-30. Hey, Rowdy, thank you for the two. Or for the five, sorry. Uh, how can there be a big three if the possibly second player is in, isn't included? Yeah. Yeah, true. There's no big three because technically the number three is not Rabakana. So you're right. Okay, 15.30. First serve is a fault. Second serve. I mean, yeah, we don't say big three and then include Goff, do we? Which is really weird because... I guess because Goff just hasn't done enough over the same time period as the other two. Or three? I don't know. Maybe it's because they can't beat Shriantek. Maybe that's why. She can't beat Shriantek, so that's why. I don't know. 15.30. Why, do, why is that? Back end of back end rallies. That goes down line in the net from uh, Rodicano, 1540. Um, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't put Goff in the same bracket as the other th those three, though. Not yet, because she's got one slam. She played really well for a, like a couple of months, but overall, like, I mean, Sabalenka's got two slams. Rabakina, you know, has got uh, 1,000 titles, but I mean, if Goff wins another 1,000 title. Or if Goff wins here, you've got to talk about her in the big four, maybe. Big four? Maybe it's a big four. As Shriantek loses the point, 30-40. Is it a big four, maybe? All right. All right. 30-40, still break point for a double break. Thirty forty is Rodikanu. And how, it, yeah, it is a big four, right? Goff's got to be included in the big four. The third now the back of Rodic uh, Shriantek. Four now Rodikanu, the four of Shriantek. Rodikanu with the four and again, the four of Shriantek. Goes down the line, the back of Rodikanu. Shriantek backhand is long, and we're a deuce. Um, yeah. Goff and Rodikanu both have seven titles each, yeah. But what is, I mean, do they have different titles? Like in terms of like, weight. They've both got one slam. Rebakken has got two 1,000 titles, right? Goff's got one. But I think the reason why, it's because, it's because, of the, for me, I think it's because of Shriantek winning. You've got to beat Shriantek, right? Back in the back end rally. Deuce here is Rodikano tries to survive. Four now from Shriantek, the back end of Rodikano. Into the back of Shriantek. Rodakano with the back on the stretch. Shriantek down the line. Into the slice forehand of Rodakano. That goes in. Shriantek with the back end down the line again. Rodakano with the lob. And it's in the net. Advantage Shriantek. Maybe because. Because Rodakano. Uh, what's her name? Uh, Goff has a bad record against Shriantek. Whereas the other two can beat Shriantek. Maybe that's why it doesn't feel like. I don't know. Like the big, the big, the top three that were, right, they all could beat each other. Whereas there's, there's a clear difference between Goff and Shviontek. Whereas, I mean, maybe Goff Rabakin or Goff Sabalenka is a little closer. 
As that goes into the slice, Shriantic, Shriantic in the net, and it's deuce. Whereas, like, Sabalenka could beat Rabakina, Rabakina could beat Sabalenka. Shriantic could beat Sabalenka, Shriantic could lose to Sabalenka. Rabakina can beat Shriantic, Shriantic can beat Rabakina. Goff can't beat Shriantic constantly, like, consistently. So maybe that's why we don't, it doesn't feel like she's in that group. I don't know. One, a big one and middle three. I mean, I think, so, I mean, we'll find out tomorrow if Rabakina can get Shriantek, but if Shriantek loses to Rabakina on clay tomorrow, that's a huge deal. All right, advantage, Rodokanu. Chat, what's your dream final with the players that are left? Hmm. <laughs> what's your dream final with the players that are left? Advantage Rodokanu. And that includes Rodokanu, who's still in the draw as of now. Coco versus Iga. Okay. As we're back in return now to the back end of Rodokanu. Down the line to the four of Rodokanu now. She wants to get to four on the stretch. And it goes long and Rodokanu holds. Three, two, second set. Rabakina versus Emma. Okay. Rabakina Goff. Yeah. What about Vondi? Nobody wants to see Vondi. <laughs> Nobody wants to see Vondi. I wouldn't mind seeing Rebecca and Goff. Like, not that I... I mean, I want Eager to win everything on clay because I think she's a clay queen, but I wouldn't mind seeing Rebecca and play, play Goff. That would be... It's kind of like what we saw in Monte Carlo. It's like everybody wanted to see Sinner versus Djokovic, but we got Rude versus City Pass, and that was interesting. Like, it wasn't a great match, but it was a, like an interesting idea. Rather than having the top guys all the time. So having like three versus four instead of one versus two would be fun. But I would love to see Shviontek in the final. I want Shviontek to win everything on clay just to show that she is the greatest clay court player to ever live. That's not Rafa. Emma versus Goff, okay. We're back in a Vondi. What's that look like? I want to see Von Drusov a Goff tomorrow for sure. I hope Rabakina wins. Nice. Rabakina Coco could be a good top four matchup. Yeah. I mean, Vondi versus. What's Von Drusov a Rabakina look like? Because Vondi Shriantek is not great. I think Shriantek beats her, right? But Vondi versus Goff. Uh, sorry, um, Rabakina. What's that look like? Former Wimbledon champions on clay. Let's go. 1-1. One, one. Ooh, okay. Well, they played in Rome last year, and it was an easy win hmm. to Rabakina. What about... Re I mean, Goff's got 3-0 over Vondi, but the last time they played was three sets, so... Something. Never played on clay. Oh, no. Goff, Rabakina, probably. Best... Ma it could be the... It would be the best final. Fiontek, Goff, final. Nah. Eh. We've seen that. Doesn't end well. And if uh, Kostruk beats Goff, I think tomorrow, and Shviontek were back in tomorrow, everyone's going to say tomorrow's the final, right? Everyone's going to say tomorrow's match is the final, not the final in the final. All right, 3 2. Shviontek with a set and a break here. Now, as the return goes in the back end of Rodokanu, back in our from Shviontek goes long. Love 15. What the hell is Steph doing? Is he going to lose? Chad, is Pass going to lose? Is it raining in Bucharest again? Or Munich or wherever the hell that... Bucharest? Is it raining? Setting a break down, FAA. What the hell? Garcia's about to win. Steph's going to lose. If Steph loses, chat. I laugh out loud. Lol. 500s. Never. Rude's going to win. It's raining in Munich as well. All right, love 15. Uh, Shvantec serves. Into the forehand of Rodokano, and Rodokano smacks it out. 15 all. Fifteen all. Uh, 
And Shvantik serves again. A fault. Second serve. Sends out the back end of Rodakanu, back in it from Shriantek. The back end of Rodakanu, but Rodakanu hits it out. 30 15. Hey, Rowdy, think of it the two. Von Drusova versus Shriantek is the final you want to see. Okay. Fair enough. Oh, it worked. Hang on. It's not too bad. Rowdy. Von Drusova Swiatek. All right. Think of it the two. I don't know why that worked. All right. 30 15. Serve to the forehand of Rodokanu. The return goes in now to the back of Sviantek as Rodokanu with a slice forehand goes down the middle and Sviantek smacks the backhand cross court winner and it's 40 15. 40 15, by the way. Happy Overs Day, everybody. Can we just get a round of applause? Can we get some cake in the chat for, for Overs Day? It's, happy, it's an Overs Day. Every match so far has been the over. Happy Overs Day, everybody. If you don't know what that is, I'll tell you later. If you do know what that is, happy Overs Day. Eat some cake. Uh, Shriantek serves. Where's the cake? Location in the chat. Yeah, cake in the chat. Cake in the chat. All right, 40-15. Happy Overs Day, everybody. It's been a great day for the Overs. Serving the back in a Rodokano. Return goes in, uh, goes out. And it's a 4-2 lead. Shriantik in the second. And that's it. Happy Overs Day. <laughs> what does cake have to do with it? What do you mean? It's that we're celebrating with cake. We celebrate Overs Day with cake. What do you mean? Cake... Everything's better with cake. All right. Rodokan is serving 4 2. And they're serving the net. Second serve. Second serve. Yeah, bring cupcakes if you want. That's fine. Serving to the 400 Shriantek. Return goes in the net. 15 love. Yeah, why not bring ice cream? Bring ice cream, it's fine. Bring ice cream if you want. Tiramisu. Go crazy. 15 love. As Rodokano serves out wide. In the back of Triantec. Rodokano, forehand inside out to win a great shot. 30 love. Now the Olympics does not give points. 30 love. Strawberries and ice cream. Hey, you can bring strawberries and ice cream. That's a bit fancy, but okay. You can bring it. All right, 30 love. Serve it to the back of the uh, Shvilchek. Back of the right corner with a net. 30 15. 30 15. Uh, Rodokano serves again. Into the front of Shriantek. Back in a Rodokano. Again to the back of Shriantek. Down the line to the front of Rodokano. Shriantek gets it down the line to the back of Rodokano. It's in the net and 30 all. And Rodokano just looked like she's running out of steam here. All right. 30 all. 30 all. Thirty-all, Rodokanu with a serve. Thirty-all, serve. Nope. By the way, Goff's coming on after this, um, so stay tuned. Goff Kostyuk. If you watch the Australian Open match, you'll know what that's all about. As Rodokanu serves, nice. All right, forty thirty. 
Big serve from Raducanu. To take this game. Forty thirty. As Raducanu serves. Down the tee, the forehand of Triantec. Forehand of Raducanu. Into the back of Triantec. As Raducanu with the backhand slice on the stretch. Triantec backhand. Down the line. Raducanu is over the forehand lob. And Triantec with a smash. Raducanu with a slice again. Goes in. Triantec forehand. Raducanu gets his right with the pass. What a rally. This is going to be on TV, bro. Raducanu with a big smile and a fist bump. Great hustle. Great rally. And Raducanu holds 4-3. Triantec with a break. But that was a great rally for him to win. Great hustle. All right. 4-3. Four, 4-3 three. Four, three in the second. Hey, what's going on, Colin? Usually everything is better than cake. Um, yeah. <laughs> One in the chat if you need me to explain what Overs Day is. Does everyone know Overs Day? I mean, it's been a, we've had it before. It's not the first Overs Day, but it's Overs Day today. Do I need to explain it? Or is everybody up to, up to speed? Everybody understand? Do I need to explain what Overs Day is? I'm sensing you want Shviantek to win. Uh, really? Okay. Never heard of it. Okay. Never heard of it. Yeah, so, okay. So, Overs Day. Just tell us, mate. All right, I'm getting there. Jesus Christ, mate. Should chill. Um, so, Overs Day is when all the matches are over a certain amount of games. So, for example, this match, the over for this match was 18 games combined. We're over that, so it's an Overs match. And that, uh, that means it's an over. Now, the other two matches, I think it was like 22 was the overs day. It was the overs. And they went over 22 games combined as well, the first two matches. So we've had three out of the four matches are over. So it's an overs day because all the matches are going over what the games should be. Does that make sense? So it's an overs day. It is officially overs day. Now, the next match, we just want it for the next match. The next match could be over as well. We'll see. I'm still confused. Okay, we'll... I can't explain any more than that. What's an over? An over is a betting term when the games with the games combined add up to a certain score. And the over under, the over under is where the line is drawn. So for this match, the over or the under, the over under, the line was 18 and a half. So the games combined are now 20. That's more than 18 and a half. So it's an over. When it's under that, it's an under. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Who's leading? Triante. Scoreboard's broken. Okay. Love 15 is going to find a fine rally. Triante puts it away. 15 all. So we all, we're, we're good. I get that now. Good. We got it? Good. So it's overs day. When the matches all go over... Then it's an over today. And we all eat cake. We celebrate with cake. And today we celebrate with cake. It's always a great day when it's an overs day. Where's Greg's? Greg's is the uh he's the king of the overs. Where's he at? Alright. 15.30 here. Chance for Rodicon to break back. All right, 15.30. Uh, he's going to return now to the Fornish Fiance. Fornish now from Rodicanu. It's a drop shot, but it's wide. That was a smart shot, though. Would have been effective. 30 all. Did the bookie serve the cake? Uh, no. We bring our own cake. There's cake in the chat. Steph's going to lose, isn't he? Okay, 30 all. 
Fiance serves again. Fiance serves to try and keep this break. Serve goes in the corner of Rodakanu. For Ash Fiance, the back end of Rodakanu. Ash Fiance gets a point. Rodakanu over hits it. 40 30. 40 30. And the winner of this plays we're back in it tomorrow. I think it's the first match tomorrow as well, so get excited. Ah, 40 30. Serve in the fourth of Rodakano. Return goes back to Triantec. Rodakano with a forehand cross court. Triantec gets it, but hits it out. We're a deuce. Still a chance here for Rodakano to get the break back. Deuce. Why are we not streaming Steph? I don't know. Because I didn't think he would be losing. I, I had full confidence in City Pass not to lose. So blame him for uh, for making it awkward for no reason. Uh, Shriantek serves. Sidibas so still parting in his head in Monte Carlo. Yeah, dude's hung over. As we deserve now the backhand of Rodakano. Great return. Shriantek gets it with the backhand on the stretch. Rodakano cross court. Shriantek gets it down the line but hits it. Into the forehand of Rodakano. Forehand Shriantek inside out. Great shot. Man, Shriantek hit the line on one of those shots. And that's what set it up. Advantage Shriantek. Great hitting. Great hitting from Shriantek. And Rodakano just says she's so quick. Did she say she's so fucking quick? That, you can't say that. It's rude. We all get demonetized if you say that. Okay. Advantage, Shriantek. Serve in the back end of Rodakanu. Return goes to the back end of Shriantek. Rodakanu. With the backhand down the line. Hit the tape goes in. Shriantek runs around. Hit the backhand. Back end of Rodakanu to the back of Shriantek. Again, the back end of Rodakanu. Shriantek. Backhand. Down the line. Into the forehand of Shriantek. As Rodakanu is a forehand cross. Uh, sorry, Shriantek is a forehand cross goal winner. This is going to be on Dennis TV, bro. All right. 5 3. Shriantek. 5 3. Shriantek. Okay. 5-3. And Shriantek kind of giving the thumbs up there because that was just too good. Shriantek's had to play her best today. All right, 5-3. Rodakanu serving to stay in the match. Two hours played in this one. What's up, Alex? How you doing? All right. Rodakanu serves. A fault. Second serve. Second serve. Down to see the backhand of Shriantek. Forna Rodakanu. And Shriantek gets the backhand on the stretch. Rodakanu gets it to the forehand of Shriantek. Into the forehand of Rodakanu. Shriantek cross foot again to the forehand of Rodakanu. Into the backhand slash Shriantek. Rodakanu with a forehand winner. Straight in the corner. That's a great shot. 15 love. Nice hitting. 15 love. Fifteen love. As Rodikano serves again. There's a fault from Rodikano. Second serve. Second serve in the backhand is a double fault. Check myself in there. Okay. 15 all. That was Cam being sarcastic as to why we aren't watching Quincy Pass. No, seriously. I thought City Pass would win easily. I didn't, I mean, Diaz Acosta's been good, but 
All the good clay quarters from South America haven't been haven't been good this like lately. Like Jerry's been losing. Echeverry got smoked last week. I mean, I thought Steph would probably win without having to play a, an epic. Anyways, return goes into the form of Shriantek, but Rodokano hits it out. 1530. 1530. A chance for Shriantek to finish it here. 1530. Fifteen thirty. As Rodikano serves. A fault. Second serve. Second serve into the backhand of Shriantek. Return is good to the slash of Rodikano. As Shriantek hits the backhand inside out down the line, and Rodikano gets it with the slice, but it's a long match point. Two of them to uh, to Shriantek to take. A spot against Rabakina tomorrow. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, you know that's going to be good. A rematch. 1540. Shviontek to set up that Rabakina rematch. Serving to the back of the Shriantek. Return goes in the form of Rodokanu. And Rodokanu hits it out. Shriantek gets the win. But hey, look. Credit to Emma. She was so good this week. She's been so good the last couple of weeks. And she loses the best clay court player on the planet. I mean, come on. Great result for Rodokanu. Push Shriantek. But Shriantek is the queen of Stuttgart. And the queen of Porsche. Even though I know that Rodokanu is sponsored by them too. All right, GG's. Shviontek Verabakina. Woo! <laughs> Love that. Love that matchup. That was, a, that was a long straight sets win. That was a very long straight sets result. A very tough straight sets victory. Unbelievable. All right, Rodikana gets waved unbelievable. off. Unbelievable. 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 I don't care about what I was saying. Rowdy. The Polish punisher Iga Swiatek, but to Radikana's credit, Iga had to play well to beat her, and she didn't beat herself, so that's a improvement. Yeah, hopefully Radikana can keep this level, because if she keeps this level, she's going to start beating a lot more players than she loses to, so. Uh, Radikana playing like this is so much more fun. When when she's playing well, it's so much more fun. Because uh, otherwise people just like come in here and, you know, like to, like to hate on her for no reason. All right. Um, I'm going to send you over to the golf match. Goff versus Kostuk, our final match of the day. Uh, very interesting matchup. So jump over there, talk amongst yourselves, and I'll be back in about five minutes. But uh, yeah, good win by Shviontek. Had to push uh, to get the win. It was uh, 7 6 6 3. She takes the dub. She gets into the semi final. She plays Rebecca tomorrow. Of course, we're going to watch that. Uh, but Rebecca, uh, sorry, Rodicano, sorry, a great week. Uh, and hopefully it continues into Madrid. Golf coming up next.